bumps the axe. Prove yourself. Like Charles can level Burrow Strike and get the stun timing right. He'll be able to get the stun over onto S4 with Bramble. Flying was still able to get the bounty room, but uh, it's first blood onto the Weaver. Run over for the other. Like Charles can level Burrow Strike and get the stun timing right. He'll be able to get the stun over onto S4 with Bramble. Flying was still able to get the bounty room, but uh, it's first blood onto the Weaver. Cool. Even though we got four of the swipes on, they are level ones. Oh, Burrow Strike on bottom. Heavy damage oh. after the Weaver. Once again, they get the pop. Fly can't do enough to stop it. He ended up having to soul rip aggressively into Chalice. And oh, he's actually, dead too. Yeah, Barra Strike. Mango. There's Mango into Barra Strike inside the tree line. And then from the realm, FY. Oh, wait a wait, second. Where'd the damage go? You've got support arriving from S4. Fly is still alive. He had 1200 HP. Radiant FY will be able to get oh. the kill. Advantage of is how easy of a setup the Sanking Stun is for Brambles and how much damage the Brambles deal. Oh, S4, oh. great run around using that extra movement speed of Shikuchi to find Chalice and he gets him around, had the vision. Samael's Tiny is just having an absolute field day and they're going again up on top. Decrepify, Blast, as the Winter Wyvern who's the primary focus and Arteezy just rips him apart. The Weaver is a bit tricky too, a lot of the time with the Soul Rip back up. Fly, is he gonna try for this? Crit's having another crack up on top. It's not happening. Oh, he keeps uh, going. Uh, wait, he's actually going in. Oh, I got it's him. Decay. Wait, what? How's that enough? Somnus is coming down to the bottom lane. They've been so aggressive. S4 Shikuchi's forward. And Somnus, he's going to be ready to open up with a Barra Strike. That's a quick and easy kill onto the Undying. They don't enough, have enough damage normally. But no abilities left. The slow on Arteezy will wear off. Two seconds till Spectral Dagger. And that may not be enough. He's still got six charges. So one hit was all it was going to take from Arteezy. FY stands his ground. But Arteezy, he's a bear. They're going to start with the Cursed Crown. Searing Arrows will be do doing more than enough damage. And the Bramble's right on the money. And they're going to give the kill over to... I well, went to FY. I don't think that was intentional yet. But they find the Wyvern on top lane. Body block. Slow him up. Fly comes over. Everybody get involved. You can at least get the Fury Swipe stacks up. And then, boom, boom. Down he goes. Hey. That's an Invis rune. Tiny walks point blank range. Avalanche toss. Throws him back into fly. And with the Decrepify Blast, it got the Invis reveal on him. Thanks to Dust. EG come up. They don't have the damage output from a Klinks. Dark Will is kind of your only one to do it. Maybe with the bar Strike in from Charles. FY, they just have to heavy man it up and they will be killing oh, off some kill Spectral again. Haunt. He has the movement speed only because the Spectral Dagger was slowing him up, but Arteezy comes in. Tombstones drop a double bar Strike, but now Terrorize gets them to run away. Epicenter from Charles will slow them during the run, and FY looking for that extra damage, but he's getting drained out by Crit. This is their carry. This is the man who's going to the Shadow Realm right now. He cannot do so. No powers of Yu-Gi-Oh belong to him, and hey, this looks like a rinse and repeat. X Nova, eight Fury Swipe stacks for Arteezy to get that kill, and he'll come over for another one. SK's in the neighborhood, but maybe not that much. Somnus does a hell of a lot of damage with these Searing Arrows, and he's south. As far as like, oh, there's a fight, that's great. And he's just almost got a full tier two tower in the bottom lane. Bye, bye. Oh, it's something. The combo is pretty smart, though. It's, it's by, these all... All the zombies take two hits each, so you just let them stack up a little bit, and then... Oh, for it. straight into the fight. You just got the Aegis Immortal. Nice Terrorize. Pug is going to fall, and FY just goes in deep. Samael will fall too. Arteezy wants to fight. Remember he